first you select x values x series second one no not there not there not there second one is x then hmm. y we finished hmm. then both the lines is overlapping you have uh, no you have not drawn this both this second line no second line this one not appeared then what happened actually you have selected same same uh, series you have to select this one hmm. delete uh, correct yes hmm. Hmm. enter ok Okay. You see the graph. Ah, one point is there. Anyhow, this is okay. And you plot this one, last one. So you are first time uh, in Excel. That's why you are facing difficulty. But it is once you habituated, it will be very easy. Now. We have uh, seen that this uh, DYDX calculation is so easy, and here you need not only uh, y is equal to x square. Any formula you give, yeah, it will calculate it. Suppose it is x cube, y is equal to x cube. Suppose. x cube then what will happen formula has changed but again you see this uh, curves automatically you will uh, get uh, the curves you need not draw every time uh, all these things only just you change the formula suppose it, it is x to the uh, it is sin x y is equal to sin x suppose now is equal to now you see this sin x curves this last formula will change so <laughs> this will be not 2x so So, sin x is equal to what will be that cos x is equal to that formula also means calculated formula, but you in uh, my case you see that I need not uh, change my formula, formula automatically taken care you see this. So, this is the advantage of having uh, with computer conventional in method if you go you cannot uh, practice so many functions will be there no manually you cannot plot a single one forget about uh, plotting different graphs hundreds uh, now uh, here uh, now i'll change it suppose it is uh, 
log uh, e to the power x. Suppose it e to the power x. Again, you see this uh, my uh, formula automatically taken care, but we have to change this formula e to the power x means dy dx e to the power x, what will be e to the power x. So, is equal to we have to change that formula, but I, I, what I uh, the may, way I have calculated it is uh, I uh, automatically taking taking care of these things. You see, e to the power x. This is the beauty of exponential curve. Its uh, derivatives are same as the curve. So this is so simple uh, calculus, is not it? What is there? any for formula you put uh, automatically it will be calculated and delta t. Uh, so, calculus is not at all a hard subject, but manually when we try to handle all these things it will become very difficult. Now, coming back to uh, integration, integration again what will happen? Let us go back to our x square. x square and here it will be I will uh, color code it otherwise we will forget this formula is to be changed every time. So, this is the uh, formula now. Now, what will be the integration of this uh, function y is equal to x square? We know that it will be x cube by 3. Let us uh, try to find out whether it is x cube by 3 or not. Now, y uh, we have y dx. You see this uh, heading is y dx. So, what is y? Y is this one is y, is not it? This column we calculated no, this column is y, this is x and this is y, is not it? So, y into del x, del x is this, enter. So, all y dx and integration of this, we take this from 0, it is started 0, you go on adding. So, this is the integration of y is equal to x square. Let us see whether it is y is equal to x square or not. We will plot another, another uh, graph for integration in short. We will we'll select data, we will remove all, add first we plot this y square. So, x this is our function and now we want to add in that our integration i n t again x this I am giving you easy clue to calculate all these functions and it is up to you to decide how you can use this. You see you told it is a function a cubical function automatically it has created a cubical function and we have not um, we have not put the formula it is not calculated from formula is not it so what is the integration of y x square we know that int y is equal to x cube by 3 so let us calculate this with x cube by 3 
is equal to x this is our x to the power cube by 3. Now, you see this green one is our calculated values. Now, can you tell why it is there difference there is gap between these two curves what we have calculated and what uh, calculated from formula why it is a difference any idea. Both are similar curves, but why there is a difference between these two this tree any idea. No, this is indefinite integral. So, a c values come no constant. So, constant makes will differentiate. So, it will appear anywhere. So, these are the things. Oh, now, you, it will uh, it will uh, fixed in your mind that there is a c values. So, shape will be same, but it will be at different places. So. But uh, conventional method we will learn that thing, but we will never see this. Here you can see this difference is because of C. The C where it will be C, then it will be uh, above or below of the actual curve. It can be anywhere no, depending on the C values. C values is the shifting of curves. So, now you see that how easy this uh, uh, integration and differentiation and for, for this uh, same sake. Now, let us have we uh, let us have this formula as y is equal to x cube y is equal to x cube. So, uh, first before before uh, putting it into uh, uh, graphing let us decide what will happen when we y is equal to x cube. How this curve will be? You come. Y is equal to x cube curve. X cube by 3 it will be same shape. No? You will try, yeah. Very good. Then what will be the dy dx curve? Very good. Actually, touch y axis because there is no c. Is not it? Okay, no issue, no issue. Okay, now what will be the uh, uh, y dx integration of y dx? Y dx means uh, y dx. Uh, y by no, y dx means y is x cube. Oh. Hmm. X by ah, so how this car will look like? So, this curve it will, it, it will be not like that it will it will again 
some curve like that it is this will be a square curve for uh, dy dx and it will be x to the power 4 by 4 it will be somewhere it may squeeze like that but it will be like that or it can be like that we don't know but we can uh, de uh, decide depending upon this coefficients okay so we will plot it it will be this and i am i will be giving you a clue when you can decide that shape of the functions Simply you remember, suppose you have a y is equal to x, y is equal to x square, y is equal to x cube and there can be other factors 2 x plus something 2, y is equal to x to the power 4 plus 3 x, y is equal to x to the power 5 plus 7 x something like that plus 2, y is equal to x to the power 6. So, this will be that is so, how this shape of this curves will be by seeing simply you can you should able to tell this curve will be when y is equal to x it will be a line like that you follow and when it is a power of 2, 4, 6, 8 all even powers even means it is 2, 4, 6, 8 all these numbers. So, these curves will be always like that or this or this will be from uh, top to top or bottom to bottom, but it will be same side it will start from the uh, bottom and come back to bottom or start from top come uh, go back to the top. So, all square function x square x to the power 4 x to the power 6 x to the power 8. So, by looking into highest power you should able to tell the shape of these graphs yes ready. And all even powers will be even powers will be like that it will start from bottom to